food I'm vlogging. And in today's vlog, we're here at the MX Masters at Canada Heights. Elliot, um, Jad, he's gone somewhere. I think he's in the track walking at the moment. But yeah, Elliot's going to be riding this weekend. Um, there was already racing on today, so we're just about to go walk the track, and the track is look, from what I've seen on Instagram, it's looking really good. And, and I'll sort of do like an edit of the track as well. <laughs> Looking at the track now, looks quite sort of sandy but stony. Elliot, there's no new shopper. It's gone. I love you. As you can tell, we're back in the track walk now. Oh. Yeah, but Elliot's just watching the latest um, vlog on the mountain bike, so make sure you go watch it. It'll be in the top corner, probably about. It'll be in the top corner there. Or this side. So make sure you go click that and watch that video because it's a good video. Here's um, just a quick look of it. So that is a video, so yeah. The Jenny out, wrong side. Getting the Jenny out, right side. There. Hello, Chef Elliot. Do you want me to plug it in? Yeah. And where are the leads? In the top, in the same here. Okay. Here. Jenny done. Elliot, I'm gonna have something completely different today. Pizza with ham. Not just a plain margarita or anything, with ham. You can show me how to cook Yes. Come to the oven. Yep. Cook the gas. Turn the gas on. Yep. Get it to a nice heat. Undo a wrapper on the pizza. Take the sleeve off. Place it in the oven. Like that. Push it in. Shut the door. Wait 20 minutes. No. I need my scissors out. Oh. What? Dinner's done by Chef Elliot. I'm Natasha. Jad's gone missing again. And I live in Manchester. So, oh, it's really bright on here. Like, it always rains. Like, That's better. <laughs> oh, B. No. Where, where, where's Elliot gone? Where's Jad gone? Tuesday, Where's Louis gone? I'm here. Elliot's just having his um, creamy stuff. Creamy stuff? Rice pudding. Creamy stuff. What is it? Rice pudding. You like that? Fruitful. Is it actually like rice? Mm. Mm. Bee looks like she's enjoying it. <laughs> hey! What's your name? You can take it up back. Right, so I'm about to go to bed. See you in the morning. Bye. Ah, so it is now the morning, as you just saw. Elliot's getting all of this kit on, um, and it is permanently supposed to be very, very hot. It's supposed to be getting up to 31 degrees. What, for most people, say is really, really hot. So, 
It's going to be very, very hot weather. They're going to need to water the track quite a bit, I think, um, or it will get very, very dusty. Um, in qualifying, he's going to be wearing, and maybe for the races, he's going to be wearing the red and blue Troy Lee kit. What I honestly think is my favourite most cross kit. Um, it just looks so cool. The front looks really cool with all the gear tech on it, and so does the back. So Elliot is just about to head up for qualifying. I'll pick the vlog after he's back, and yeah, good luck. So, in qualify, Elliot did come um, fourth, but it is very, very hot out here. Jad, is it hot? Dying, bro. Dying. <laughs> it's, yeah, very, very hot on the track. So, I'll probably catch up with the vlog in about 10 more minutes then. Yeah. So in qualify, it was actually Graham Owen who did win, then Jake Nichols, and then Gert Kresanoff. So they're the top three riders in the fastest 40. Then in then 250s part in that. And then Josh Gilbert in first. Then Zed Brown. Then Martin Barr, um, who did get third. So they were top three in the MX2 in the fastest 40. And yeah. Go. Um, yeah, qualifying was alright, obviously uh, fresh at Watsfield the other week and a bit sore, but um, yeah, it was alright really. Um, finished fourth, so it wasn't too bad, still got a good pick for the gate, and I feel like I was just getting better every lap with the body, so um, yeah, we'll see what we can do in the race. It's two good starts today, I think it's going to be a hot one, so that can serve the energy a bit, and um, yeah, hopefully, hopefully try and get her back on that top step. Last clip you did see was um, Elliot lying on the floor because um, he did he did get second, but his back was really really painful because um, he did have a crash at Watersfield the other week, so that sort of sets him back a bit. So he is still hurting from that, and yeah, getting all of his goggle prep done, ready for the next race. Did you, how did you find the track? That's alright, rough, 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 but that's alright. Too bad. Yeah. Um, it looks actually quite sandy out there, sandier than it used to be. Yeah, it's a lot of sand and it changed a lot of it up, but yeah, it's good. It's good they got a lot of water in it, to be fair, from you know, it being so dry, so they put a lot of water in them. I actually had to bring drinking water. But someone told me that's actually drinking water. You said you could go around the train just drink it? Like 900 pounds a load, it, like it was. So yeah, we've done. Spent some money, but. No, MX National is um, providing another great meeting. But you did just see um, a 
couple of clips um, in like the crowd with there was it like a Stephen Lemoyne memorial sort of thing and um, because he did got, die about a year ago so they did a tribute thing every year so far they've done MX National so they did like a lap of honour for him and yeah. How many terrace are you running? 14 so I didn't have many. Like half one. So. I probably don't need 14 on this. I'm gonna get a whole shot. Right, just watching a bit of racing. Yeah. Yeah, under the bridge. Watching the track, I'm getting it all ready. Um, for all the other classes, it'll be quite good for um, Elliot for the next race because the next race will be his last race. But if he does win, he will win it overall for today. Um, he'll be and it's like the Stephen and Wild sort of trophy thing. So if he does win the last one, he wins um, the thousand pound cash and the Stephen and Wild um, big trophy will be very good if he can win. So they are just um, sort of redoing this bit down here quick, sort of trying to flatten it all up because there was um, that crash what I set up here. Um, did just lift in and um, slight bit of um, hole on the ground will send them to go over the bars and that so yeah. And it's just uh, the co-track builder as well, helping on the side. I think we're a bit late. Double vlogging. I'm not getting off. I think you're a bit late for the track walk. So, Elliot's just getting ready now to go for his uh, second race. Quite a big one. How are you feeling ready for the next race? Do you want to do, sir? Yeah, right. I think you need a bit of a brighter kit though, he won't be able to see you. Try and hold to as hard as you can, but uh, you can 
Right, so Ellie did have a not so good of a break. He did have a very good side. He did crash on the start, so that held him back a lot. He pulled through and did get the fourth row pull, so he didn't make the podium. So we'll be going home and very shortly. I still need to finish off filming the 125 and the 85. So I'll speak to you guys in a bit. So, guys, it's now the end of all the racing. Um, I've actually got my forks in from the mini bike channel. I'm going to give them to FTR because um, they're going to give them a full servicing. So, a big shout out to FTR for doing all of this. And the link will be down in the description. And yeah. So this is FTR suspension guys, so if any of you do need anything done, make sure you hook them up and go check them out. And that is just a uh, wonderful gesture. Um, yeah, that was, uh, oh, I'm getting a bit croaky thinking about it. Um, just, uh, well done. So guys, that is now the end of the MX Nationals Canada Heights. Um, if you did just see that then, um, Jake Nichols did win uh, the big trophy in the end, won a thousand pounds um, and the person who had him the trophy was uh, actually Stephen Lamar's sister, um, so that was very like emotional, but um, yeah, well done for Jake Nichols for winning, well done to Graham and well done to Gert Crescent for getting the third, so yeah, they all rode really good. And we are off home now, and I'll see you guys when we're home. So guys, it's now the end of today's vlog. It's now the current day um, after the MX Nationals. It was a, such a good weekend, guys. I really hope you've enjoyed today's vlog, guys. And remember, keep that smile on your face, guys. And remember, keep ripping, keep running, like, share, and subscribe. So yeah.